Hi, in this video we're going to show you an alternative to Microsoft Office. So if you're looking for something free and you don't want to pay for the yearly subscription for Office, uh, you could try this free app. It's called Only Office. So it has similar versions of the Microsoft Office apps. So once you install it, you have your main tool here. And then you could do a document, a spreadsheet, a presentation, or create a PDF form. So it's not going to have a version of Outlook, but if you want to do, you know, documents, spreadsheets, and presentations, you could do so. All right, so it even comes with some templates here that you could go through and separate it into categories. And you could search for them and also pick the country where they're from. Show your recent files, local files, connect to the cloud if you want to use their cloud service, you could do that. And there's some basic settings as well. Okay, so this document here is actually a Word document that I opened within the program, so I could open that up. And then you can see it opens up just fine and have all your tabs up here similar to Word. And they even have some plugins as well. And you have your formatting options here, print options. And when you go to file, you have, you know, save options. You could save it as an open office XML document, which still uses .docx like Word. You know, RTF, text file, PNG, and so on. Then you also have some advanced settings here. If you go back to the file menu, Okay, and one thing you'll notice too, you could go back to the main tab here, click on spreadsheet, so it'll open it in the same program here, so you don't have to open a separate program when you're working on a spreadsheet or a presentation. Okay, let's try and open an actual Microsoft Excel spreadsheet from here. There you go, see it does a pretty good job there, similar tabs and tools, formulas and data, pivot tables, even some sharing options, protection options, plugins. Okay, then we have the presentation feature here. So it starts out with a blank slide, and then we could open a PowerPoint presentation too if we wanted to. So that works out just fine. All right, then we have the PDF form option here. So this looks similar to the document tool here. So if you notice, you have a form section here where you could create a form with some boxes and drop downs, check boxes, and so on. So that's nice as well. All right, so there is your quick overview of Only Office. As you can see, it's you know pretty powerful tool for free. And if you don't want to use Office, you can still open up your Word, Excel, and PowerPoint files and edit them within the free tool here. All right, I'll put a link in the description where you can download it and you can try it out for yourself. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Mm -hmm.